Well, for the university, uh, this is a really uh, incredibly important day. Uh, we have the final piece of the funding jigsaw in place one, which is going to be a full, a operational, effective university campus. Not only that, it's going to be a high quality campus, it's going to be a global exemplar. Uh, we're going to have people coming from all over the world to look at how we do it, how we work so well with industry on the campus, how we share facilities, and you're going to find uh, what Swansea is doing today, other parts of the world will be doing tomorrow. Uh, I mean, what I notice, of course, especially with, with engineering, is, is constant investment in new facilities is so crucial to attracting new students. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. And staff. Yeah, of course. And staff, of course. The, what it means for the university as well, you've got to ask well, what has it been for the staff? Well, we're going to have some of the best research facilities for engineering and for business uh, academics in the whole of the UK. Uh, what does it mean for students? What unique opportunities for students? Because they'll be able to work with companies, do projects with companies, and some of the major companies we are talking to want to get involved in teaching. This will uh, create opportunities for our students. The companies we're talking to are saying they want more good graduates, they want more skilled graduates, they want more enthusiastic graduates. Uh, so working closely with these companies is going to create those opportunities for them. Then for Swansea, well this really puts Swansea on the map. We're told in Brussels by people working for the European Commission that this is the best project they've seen in the whole of Europe led by a university. We're not just doing academic <coughs> courses in, in a campus university. We're, this is about developing students in character, personality, yes. uh, and, and, and the, it's the campus culture which does that. You're right, of course. This is a wonderful day for Swansea, for the university and for Wales. We know that this campus will be a world leader in terms of engineering. It'll attract the best academics, the best students from around the world, and ultimately, it'll create jobs locally. It will show that we have here a university that's invested its money, along with European money, in creating, I believe, one of the best engineering departments in the world. We know there's a shortage of engineers, and Swansea is well placed now to help to fill that gap and help Wales prosper in the future. Uh, there'll be a lot of things going on. The companies want to actually work with students, uh, and for students, there'll be unique opportunities. Uh, to get, get employment uh, and to be able to demonstrate their skills. Uh, in fact, in talking to the companies who are involved with us here, they're very, very keen to improve what they call talent flow into their companies. They want more good graduates, they want more exciting, enthusiastic graduates, and they want, that's why they want to be working with students. We are extremely excited to, to have concluded um, what, what has been quite a detailed planning um, and legal negotiation. We can now concentrate on the delivery of um, what is a major two and a half year building programme. We've started with a, with a lot of machinery on site um, and the main contractor will start in July. So we've just been down to the second campus for the first time um, with the rest of the Xin Xin full-time officer team. Um, very, very exciting. The, um, the area and the size is certainly bigger than the Singleton footprint. Um, so very, very excited to see what that is going to look like in the next couple of years. Um, what I'm especially looking forward to is exactly how students are going to be engaged in uh, the movement of three colleges from this campus to the Bay Campus um, and over the occupancy phase. So yeah, very exciting. Um, a couple of big challenges, but nothing we can't beat. It's a huge project. We're talking about just the building phase, uh, employing nine, ten thousand. So I think everyone's got to be astounded at just the scale of it. As a consequence of what we do on the campus, attracting large companies in, working with SMEs, spinning out companies, we're going to see the growth of high-tech clusters, uh, and in 10 years' time. I mean, it won't just be the campus, but it will be all sorts of industrial development, manufacturing development, that's taken place in the region as a result of the attraction of the university. No, this is a startlingly exciting day for Swansea, for the university, for our staff and for our students.